Welcome! In front of me is a Samsung Galaxy Note 10 Plus and today I will show you a couple ways that you can take a screenshot on this device. So start off by finding whatever you want to capture. I'm just going to use the screen itself as an example. But you can open any kind of app and do it in any way. So the first way would be probably the most common one uh, is volume down and power key. And all you need to do is here, instead of holding it like on every other device, you just need to press it like so. And does this animation and then you can find your image right there. So just tap on the line. So that is the image that we have just captured. So I'm just gonna move it to trash. Now, the other way you can do it is by swiping your palm across. So let me try to do it. There it is. Seeing it that it did it again. So you, all you want to do is just swipe your palm across the screen. That is another way. And the third way is more of a selective way. So with a pen, again, that's right here. And it's by default here. So smart select, stop on it. And here you get to select whatever you want. Now we have a couple of different ways you can do it. You can select it basically by a square, uh, your own or a circle. So I'm just going to showcase everyone. So this one creates basically all like this. Um, now let's actually, now whatever you select to capture, you can then tap here to download it. So another way to do it. Let's actually, can I remove this? Let's try this again. Um, so if you go back to Smart Select, you also have this, which will allow you to specifically select whatever you want to select actually, as you can see. And, and then you have another way of doing it by just circular motion. So it just creates a round space to select. And that is basically all the ways you can capture it. Now, whenever using the S Pen and so doing a selective way, you'll have to tap here to actually later on download this. So saving image to the gallery. Otherwise, if you leave this, it won't be saved. So make sure you do that. And yeah, that is basically all the ways you can capture a screenshot here. And if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.